Today we are going to talk about internships. You already know its importance. You already know that having an experience of internship increases the chances of getting hired exponentially in campus and off campus interviews. But no one ever tells you how to search for an internship or how to make sure you get the internship you have searched for or the most important how to make the best out of the internship you have already got so we are starting with a new initiative and are going to make a series of videos regarding internships how to search how to email for an internship how to make sure you send a proper resume with a cover letter for an internship or you can say how to make a simple message on linkedin regarding internship this video series will be useful for all the third year or second year students who are desperately looking for internships. But yes, in return, we need your motivation. Like, share and subscribe to our YouTube channel and press the bell icon to make sure you remain updated with our latest updates. Today, we are going to cover top 5 tips to find an internship and make sure you watch this video till the end to get a complete idea. Firstly, Let's see how you can find the internship. Number one is talent battle social media. Our team constantly looks out for various opportunity post notifications and job opportunities. And now we are going to start looking out for internship opportunities. So make sure you always follow us on our Instagram page, especially for the 2022 batch. The link for that is given in the description of this video. Apart from that, you can also join our WhatsApp group and Telegram channel to stay notified about the latest job and internship opportunities. Number two, LinkedIn websites and other social media. LinkedIn is growing rapidly with a lot of users posting about their requirements. It has become a major job listing media or you can say an internship listing media. You can use LinkedIn to find and apply for internships very easily. One way to do this is using LinkedIn job finder and searching internships in your area. However, a lot of users these days post their internship requirements using their regular feed post method like posting on Facebook or post, posting somewhere on social media. So similarly, they post on LinkedIn. Hence, a quick search with a hashtag of jobs or hashtag of internship can result in a lot of internship opportunities for you. From here, you can apply in the described way or just connect with the person who is posting that particular requirement with a simple formal message. But that message is also very important. And not only on LinkedIn, but a lot of companies also use the hashtag internship or hashtag jobs to post their requirements on Instagram and Facebook too. So make sure you make a productive use of your social media. So there are a lot of websites that provide a lot of internship opportunities and guide you through the process of applying one. There are many websites you might be knowing like Internshala. So they uh, basically connect you with the companies and display those internships to you, which you can apply. But make sure that uh, you try to find out the internship which is more suitable to you. Okay. There are a lot of websites doing the same thing. Okay. Fine. Uh, just posting the internship uh, opportunities. But make sure that uh, you check the skills beforehand. Uh, we recommend that you use only trusted websites. Okay. And whenever you proceed, know that if something sounds too good, then it is probably not true. Okay. So you can either verify it with us. You can send us that internship opportunity uh, to us via various our social media platforms and we will help you out to know whether it is a genuine opportunity or not. Okay. Third most important thing, internship contest and exams. As the software and technical industries are growing, they are experimenting with their work cultures. Okay, a lot of major companies like Baker Hughes, Amdocs, HP organize various contests for hiring talented individuals and interns. Okay, there are a lot of hiring drives on Hacker Earth or Hacker Rank. This is one of the best ways to land in an internship as these would be really helpful for your career. And sometimes these internships are also paid and gets you on a very reputed brand on your resume. Okay. One more important thing, not only private organizations, but public sector organizations and various government subsidiary organizations, including CSIR and ISRO, rolls out notifications for internships every year. Okay, every now and then they are going to do that. So we are also going to post about such internship opportunities on our Instagram page and on our YouTube channel. So make sure again I'm telling 
to get notified whenever the next opportunity turns up subscribe to our youtube channel and press the bell icon fourth most important thing connecting with your college training and placement officer we are surprised when some students ask us what is tpo so tpo is nothing but your college training and placement officer many students don't even know who their college and training and placement officer is but that's not the good thing okay because a college training and placement officers are a key to lot of opportunities okay we are connected to a lot of tpos and they are regularly contacted by small or mid sized organizations looking for interns and part time employees however what happens due to lack of communication or you can say due to lack of uh, requirements or low number of requirements such opportunities don't reach you or they are often turned down hence we recommend meeting your college training and placement officer once with your updated resume and let them know that you are looking for an internship so whenever they get any particular opportunity or any particular news they can notify you okay so this way when your next internship opportunity comes up your tpo can recommend your name okay that is very very important fifth old way but a very good way cold calling and connections okay we believe that one of the previous methods should work for you still if they don't you may try going all out okay you can do cold calling emailing blocking seem to be outdated okay this seem to be outdated but trust us this still work okay during my college days i have called hundreds of small scale companies in my town and check if they are having any openings with uh, for the internship opportunity you can get their phone numbers or email ids from their websites just call up a company of your domain ask them whether they have a vacancy of intern mostly you will be given an email id to send your resume on okay but uh, not all emails will be answered but one uh, thing you need to remember is internship you more you try the more the chances of getting into a good internship okay so same thing is with the linkedin same thing is with the social media just make sure you keep trying and keep it professional always every time okay getting an internship is not about where and how you apply it mostly depends upon your skill sets your resume your email your message and your cover letter that's what gets you the first call from the company if you want to know how to design the best resume which highlights your strengths and shines through the rest make sure you watch our next video because the next video will be on how to create a resume especially for internship so that is what we are going to make the next video on there is going to be a series of videos which will be focused on getting an internship okay one thing there are a lot of ways of finding an internship but trust me it is hard to get one these days hence we recommend you to try all the methods until you find the internship you are really liking to work in so that's all for this video wait for the next video and do subscribe to our youtube channel and press the bell icon thank you